coverage you can count on continues with Glenn Marini's Sports Report. It's been over 30 years since Rod Woodson played at Snyder High School, and what a football career it has been. He's been a pro bowler, a Super Bowl champ, and even a Hall of Famer. Rod's arguably the most prolific athlete in Summit City history, and starting this month, you can own a piece of his climb to the top. I love Fort Wayne, a great place to grow up. You know, and it, I, think it, I think it kept me rooted in reality, honestly. Rod Woodson was inducted into the Pro Football Hall of Fame in August of 2009. Now you can own a piece of that night, as Woodson's Hall of Fame ring is among over 70 personal items Woodson is putting up for an online auction with SCP Auctions out of California. This was stuff that was packaged up in boxes for a while. Um, you know, he certainly is uh, proud of his accomplishments, but as he told me, he'd rather put trophies up of his kids in his office than old awards that he won years gone by. Woodson's Hall of Fame ring is estimated at 40 grand. His two AFC championship rings up for auction, each in the $30,000 range. Purdue-related items like his 1984 Peach Bowl ring and a game-worn jersey could push the total of his lots quite high. Rods would probably push uh, closer to the $200,000 range after all is said and done. And again, the online bidding takes on a life of its own. So it's, sometimes it's difficult to predict. Um, and certainly if we have some you know, serious Purdue Boilermakers fans in the mix and or Steelers fans or Raiders fans, uh, again, uh, it can go in so many different directions. For fans here in the Summit City, Rod's game-used Snyder jersey is perhaps the crown jewel of his collection. Rod struck me as a very personable uh, guy, but also a humble guy. And when he made mention of the fact that he'd rather see trophies of his own kids in his office than his own, uh, that certainly uh, resonated with me. Viewing for Woodson's items began today on scpauctions.com. Actual bidding starts next Wednesday, runs through April 25th. Click on the Woodson story on Wayne.com for a link to the auction website.